All right, this is best part. I'm gonna zoom in so you can see, right? First chord is D major seven, and you know it's easier to plug if I'm down here and I have more space, and you can hear it better. <laughs> so you would grab your thumb here, and then right, and you're just doing a bar in the second fret, making sure to push down the first three strings, and you can leave the D open. And so you can pull those strings, or you can strum them. I remember uh, some of my students had an easier time just strumming it, but in the recording, it's more of a, you're hearing that plucked sound. Okay, second chord is an A minor 7, so you have your pointer over here on the C, second string in the first fret, right? And then this, your second finger is going to go to the fourth string. You pluck the same four strings or strum them. Right? Then your next chord, you only need to put your pointer on the F sharp right here, and you can pull the same four strings. And that is a G major seven. And then finally, you have a B flat. Uh, I think minor, whatever. So you're putting a bar on this time, you want your fingers to cover all the way up to the fourth string. Then you pull those same strings. Right? Or you strum them. Okay, so here we go again. It's D major 7. This time I'll strum them from the fourth string down. Then A. Then we have our. Seven, and we have our B flat something in here. The only one you might not be able to see, just to review the A minor 7, I'm on pointers on the second string here, and then it's right here on the fourth string, right? All right.